I'm obviously from from, from Sweden, and uh, I grew up in a I'd say it's a decent sized city back home, and but not compared to here, it's about a hundred thousand people living uh, in my hometown, so it's it's fairly big for being Sweden, and obviously the the weather is is quite different back home. You have all the different seasons, and, and it's really cold and snowy, so it's probably compared to the northern northern Canada so when you guys say you have a bad weather or it's it's pretty cold like days like today it's it's, it's not really comparable to, to back home and this is my fourth season and I, when I talk to my my friends and, and family back home on days like this and I say yeah it's, it's pretty chilly out it's it's raining again and, com and complaining a little bit they're like, they're like ah, I don't know if it's not as quite bad as it is, is at home so it's, it's pretty funny but if you travel to Sweden, I think there's there's a lot of different places where you, you probably would want to go. I mean, first of all, I think you'd, you'd have to go to Stockholm. I think Stockholm, is, especially in the summertime, is, is a is a beautiful city and it's it's our capital. It's got the the castle. That's that's where where the king is at. I mean, it's just got some beautiful beautiful buildings and stuff that be that's a little bit different to to what you guys got here. So I'm I'm the youngest of uh, three brothers as well and I have a sister and all my all, all my brothers played hockey too so my dad and my uncle were, were, were successful in playing hockey too they played on the elite level but my dad actually he stopped playing before I was born he he quit pretty early because uh, I think he quit when he was 29 or something like that so I think it was just one of those natural things and I think it still is in Sweden when you're a kid you play you play hockey in the in the winter and then when the summer comes you play soccer and my mom is a principal. She's been working uh, in the school system for for pretty much all her life. My mom always made sure that school was above the, the hockey and the homework had to be done before we go out and, and play street hockey. So she's always been a huge help in, in that area. She would sit down with me and, and, and help me with, with the homework for, for hours and make sure I, I got it done. A lot of guys can't really finish school because they turn pro before the school time is over but you know, I turned pro my, my last year but I still managed to finish school which in case of something might have happened when I was younger so uh, and obviously my mom was a, was a huge help to, to me finishing school so yeah. Always when we have uh, close by friends like mom and dad, brothers and sisters and anyone really we, we, we want to take them to tame us actually as Silvan is. I think that's probably one of the best steakhouse or restaurants in general that, that I like over here. Obviously it's my opinion but I think it's just incredible. The, the service there is great, the food is amazing so we always, we always want to bring them there. My most memorable hockey moments, I, I think I would have to go with two. I think the first one that comes in mind is uh, my last year when I played at home. In that year, which was obviously a, a terrific year, game six in the, in, in the final I scored, I scored a pretty special goal that I think is always going to be in the back of my mind and uh, we ended up winning that game 2-1 so just that whole year and finishing it off with winning the whole league and uh, winning the championship that was a, a great moment and my second biggest memory I think well, that would be my, my first NHL game and uh, I remember it even today I my first NHL goal as well my first game was uh, with Ottawa though in, in Winnipeg and uh, it was just a great like experience as well and it was a lot of fun and I probably didn't play my best game but uh, I mean, you know, I was so, so nervous coming into the game so uh, that was that was cool as well. Yeah. I think it's a pretty pretty a clear answer. You want to win the cup. I think that's I think that's why everyone we're all like competitors and we hate to lose and, and we want to win and to win the cup would be would be amazing, and that's 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 what we're, we're all going for. That would be really nice and a good year. Hey, Ducks fans! Uh, thanks for taking a ride with me. But it's time for me to go go to practice and uh, try to get better. Uh, but thank you, guys.